Hi guys, it's Jen here and welcome to Jen's Wild About Art. So today I'm doing a picture of a hummingbird for you and I'm doing it with my shin hand touch markers. Um, I'm using a brush tip on them. They've got a brush tip and a, a chisel tip, um, but I'm mainly using the brush tip. So I've just drawn an outline of this little hummingbird. I got this picture off uh, Unsplash, which is a free picture site. Um, and now I'm colouring him in, I, well I coloured him in with a light blue marker and accidentally I turned off my, my video to go make a cuppa and then I forgot to turn it on again so then I went straight to the darker blue. <laughs> so that's what happened there. So then I turned my recorder back on and yeah, added the darker blue and the beak and now I'm going into the wings. Um, the wings are quite translucent, quite see-through. So they're very fine feathers. So I'm going in, I've got a set of warm grey. So I'm just going in with the, the 0.5, which is the lightest grey and the softest grey. And I'm putting that on and then I'm building up just a little bit of detail um, with slightly darker tones of grey around the edges, just to add a little bit of detail to the feathers. Um, so I've done that. So I've done and added another layer and I've just added the centre lines. So now I'm adding just a few of the little details along the edge of the feathers and on the tail. He's got quite dark um, trim on the bottoms of his tail feathers. Then I've added some deeper greys into the top parts of his wing feathers. So now for the vibrant back colour. So I'm going in with a light green and I'll build up with different colours over the top of this. So now I'm going in with sort of a mid-tone green over the top, leaving, making sure to leave some light parts. And now I'm going in with, it's called peacock blue. It's like a turquoisey blue over the top. Um, and just adding that in the pattern of the feathers across his back. And then I go over just with another light green just to blend it all through. And I add a bit of a dark blue or a purpley blue around his feather lines. Take that around everywhere, following around all his back feathers. And then I put in the deepest shadow parts because he's got some very dark feathers on the top of his back. So I just take that around the trim of his feathers. Then I go in again with the peacock blue and just smooth it all out and now I'm adding some white marker just for the fine lines and the lightest details on him and I'll just pop that around his feathers and then I'll go over that again in a second once it's dry so pop the detail lines on his feathers the little veins so pop those in like that little few fed, head, fed, head feathers. I can't say head feathers. I'm trying to say fed feathers. <laughs> so now I'm going over with that turquoisey blue again, just over some of the white, just to soften it. And now I'm adding the detail into his wings. So he's got a little bit of that light blue going up from the bottom of his feathers. And I add some very dark grey into the tops of his, or top of his back and a mid-tone grey around his wing feathers and his tail feathers. Just put a bit more detail in there. So I had a lot of fun drawing this picture. I'd love it if you'd click like and subscribe and the bell icon so you can see future videos. Um, yeah, I'll see you guys next video. Have an awesome day and I'll catch you then. Okie doke. Bye.